Okay, I'm here in the dressing room, and as I promised, here is my friend Darren. I wanted to just kind of hang out with her in the dressing room and just chat oils and theater and all sorts of fun stuff. So, Hi. hello, there's Darren and there's Kelly. Hi. So for anyone who doesn't know anything about Anything Goes, Darren plays the lead, and her character's name is Reno Sweeney, yes. and then Kelly over there is playing Hope, and... Um, Hey, we're just she's hanging. She's one of the other leads. Yes. She's the is she romantic the, interest. I know, I always... Not can't. for Reno. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I always wondered, in this version, is she... I couldn't remember if like, she was the supporting lead or they're pretty. I, in this one, I she's pretty so, equal. This one's so confusing. I think it depends yeah. on what part of the show you're in. Yeah. Because like yeah. Reno is is billed as like the lead, but then really it's not so much about her. She just sings a lot. Like <laughs> Amazing Billy, stuff. The and then Billy does all yeah. the talking, but then Moonface mm -hmm. does all the funny stuff, and then Hope comes in towards the end with like two songs in a <laughs> and row. Sings her face off. Yeah. Yes. It's like, <laughs> oh wait, maybe it's Hope. Yeah. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah. She's being modest. Both of them are very humble, awesome performers. They're fabulous. So I'm going to show you guys this little dressing area. This is the coolest bottle. I had one like this from convention last year, and I broke it. Wah, wah. Here you I'm diffusing these. And she's got, okay, I was going to ask what's in the diffuser. Got the Well, I, I didn't get crazy just because there's two. Although Kelly does, <laughs> See, Kelly's an awesome. oiler. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah. I didn't know that, Kelly. Yeah. yeah, so I felt a little bit better being like, here's oh, my yeah. diffuser. <laughs> I hope you like it. In the girls' ensemble room. <laughs> Luckily, there's just a couple of us on the side that we're on. Uh -huh. And so I was like, ladies, can I diffuse? And as soon as I got the okay, I just didn't say anything else. I was like, all right. All right. Because yeah, honestly, yes. with the there's costy. They have these gorgeous costumes, which I'm going to show you in a second. In that area, that it blocks it from anybody else. Right. right. So, right. Um, I, and I just have it right in my little area, so it's kind of worked out nice. But here's really nice size dressing room, honestly. Yeah, it's oh. nice. Yeah. And you guys don't wear wigs. They wear their own hair in the show, so you have to yeah. see how fabulous this looks, you guys. <laughs> That's like yeah, so like pretty. Like no, no, you both look amazing. I love yours. Yours is what I would like to do, but mine is, she just gets to be more like young and pretty and like, here's my nice hair. I feel like mine needs to be more like, here's my hairdo. <laughs> it looks great though. I love it. it always makes me look, I feel like sometimes I look in the mirror and I'm like, man, I look like my grandmother. Yeah. I know, I have the same it's thought weird. in certain dresses. I'm like, wow, I look. Like, kind of like my grandmother. Yeah. Yeah. That's yeah. really awesome. You yeah. should find a picture <laughs> and like put it up against a picture side of yourself. By side. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. tell me I because we're talking about essential oils and you know everybody wants to know about that. Yes. So funny story very quickly, Darren was the one who introduced me to Young Living. I've talked about that in my vlogs before, but it was I think it was no, it was a year ago, January, which I can't believe it's been a year. Yeah. It was Anna Get Your Gun. Yeah. But she was diffusing thieves in the dressing room. And I was like, what is that amazingness? And then she shared her lozenges with me. And I was just like, this stuff's amazing. So that's kind of the reason that I use a lot of them in my theater life. But I bring that yes, up. I remember, my memory is you were like, Sarah was like, I, I have this one from somewhere. And, <laughs> and I buy some all others. That. And I was like, uh -huh. oh that's that amazing so why don't you try young living ones <laughs> she was so nice about it guys which i appreciate because some people will be like you use other ones other oh ones. and yes yeah. of course we only want to use young living but she was so cool about it like, that's cool yeah, yeah. Like, mm, let me give you the good stuff here try this one see yeah. if you like this one and she was right it was better <laughs> just saying anywho but i was bringing that up because one of my memories of Annie Get Your Gun. She did a production of Annie Get Your Gun that I did with her here in concert last year. Yes. And she sang the role of Annie, the lead. It was fabulous. You would walk past backstage. <laughs> and I smelled, like, oh, yeah. to me, you know, the new person. I was like, I've never smelled this. I mean, it was such yeah. an awesome mix. And I think you had a concoction or a mix of oils yeah, that you used. You know, and so I, I wanted you to talk I about that a little bit. I have been making that just because I'm lazy. It was a roller that has a lot of, um, like, vocal support or like mm -hmm. um relaxing oils but it's things like um myrrh lemongrass melrose mm. frankincense lemon um it's like a bunch of things that i just uh cypress mm -hmm. yeah I so i just that. made up 
my own oil blend that I've used. I have I just haven't been using it because I started using since then. I started using the deep relief one. Ooh, I was gonna like that. warming up. So then it felt like it was overkill to use deep relief and then another one yeah. and then like a lozenge. Yeah, because I was like, that's a lot of smell. It is. <laughs> <laughs> or rehearsal. So right now, I don't use the roll, my voice roll on, at least right for this show. I do an apple. I saw that. So you eat an apple in every show. Yeah. Now, well, is I've there never a... made it all the way through the apple. I throw, <laughs> I throw the apple, the rest of it away because I don't, well, sometimes they take it home. Huh. But um, is there a trick or a reason it's specifically an apple? Uh, is it a vocal it just, thing? It, I, it makes me feel like I'm not going to, oh, well, actually, it makes me, like, not feel dry. Awesome. Like the, the um, apple Like the pectin, juice, maybe? I yeah. guess, yeah. Is, is sort of similar to um, saliva. Oh, wow. Yeah, so I do trip. an apple, and then mm -hmm. I do my water, mm -hmm. which has lemon in it. I was doing peppermint in the water, but I decided to just do lemon since mm -hmm. I was... Yeah, mm -hmm. so I'm just doing lemon in the water and then an apple, and then I have a lozenge because mm -hmm. yes, thieves lozenges. thieves lozenges are the best. Yes, and then I do a, a nitro at intermission, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> which you wouldn't think is really gonna be all that helpful because you're like, oh yeah, you know the little nitro thing, yeah whatever. Mm -hmm. But I didn't do it yesterday, and so I get into blow Gabriel blow. The first time I did it was during like a dress rehearsal. Mm -hmm. And I, oh and I drank one during intermission, and it was the best Flo Gabriel blow had ever Oops. gone. <gasps> Sorry. I killed my Fritos. I just killed her Fritos, y'all. Just kidding. I'm putting it back. I'm accident prone. Uh -huh. Okay. Anyway. So carry I, on. I did my nitro. <laughs> And, and then I did Blow Gabriel Blow, and I was like, man, this song's not that hard. Okay, I can get through yes. this song. And I was like, oh, maybe I should take that at intermission when I'm getting tired and have to do this huge song where basically we sing the song three times in a row. It's like huge, you guys. She's it. amazing. It's like yeah. not even like half of it in the mm -hmm. reprise. It's just, let's just sing it again, mm -hmm. and then let's sing it again, and then let's sing it one more time. <laughs> like, there's no real change yeah. except for the middle one modulates up at the end, which yes. is nice of them. They let it go back down for the reprise. Oof. You know. It's yeah. a lot of singing. It's Ethel. Ethel. Yes. Thanks, Ethel Merman. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Kelly, do you use oils at all? I do. Not not as much anymore. I'm kind sure. of running low. <laughs> oh, okay. It needs to reorder. But I do love I do love having feeds diffused. Oh, Everyone good. It's so nice. Isn't it? it it's really awesome. Amazing. Yeah. yeah. Awesome. I just, just didn't dusty. know if you used any oh, yeah, during yeah. your... Because yeah. some do and some don't, but... It was funny. I had a bunch on yesterday. Well, I didn't think it was very much. I put Believe on, and oh. I put it under my nose, which is the weirdest uh -huh. thing. But I was obsessed with the scent. I just got uh -huh. it yesterday. Mm -hmm. And I just put the tiniest little bit there and the tiniest little bit there. And uh -huh. I walked past with the dogs. And the stage manager was like, oh, wow, Sarah, I smell your oils. And I was like, oh, no, oh, no. But she's like, no, I love it. It uh -huh. smells so good. And I was like, woohoo. Yeah, I always get a little nervous with, <laughs> Me too. with Me like, too. not the basic oils you know like when you're right. with thieves and lavender and stuff you're you know mm -hmm. that's going to basically be fine mm -hmm. nobody's going to care or lozenges whenever i have a lozenge in, people are like oh i can smell your oils like yeah it's my lozenge. you're like yeah uh, it's a lozenge but yes. when they get into like the weirder oils like i really like joy but a lot of people don't like mm -hmm. joy so i always feel a little mm -hmm. bit like Maybe I won't wear it just in case somebody who doesn't use oils is like, what's that weird smell? Yeah, yeah, that's for sure. That's true. Well, um, do they know they need joy in their life? I'm just saying. <laughs> I, <think I, laughs> I hear so many people say that. I need joy in my life. You just need a little joy. I know. I put some of that on, I think, actually today before I left. But sometimes oh, yeah. I've noticed, have you noticed, like, I'll put some oils on, and I know that whether I can smell it or whether someone else can smell it, it's different. Mm -hmm. But like some oils, I put them on and man, they just stay. Like they linger. And then others, yeah. I'll put them on and it's like, oh, yeah. I can't smell it. So no one else can. And then I'm surprised when yeah. someone else can. Jo uh, joy lingers forever on me. Like, mm -hmm. not, I mean, mm -hmm. it's the one that I feel like I can still smell at the end of the day. But I did like white Angelica in my car on my diffuser and I like couldn't smell it at all. Yeah. I'm like, I just don't Me smell too. it at all in the car, but I did peppermint and that one was like, whoo, yeah. peppermint smell. Yeah, it's weird how yeah. some do act differently. And I feel like it's different on different people too. Mm -hmm. So yeah, I yeah. love that. Okay, I have to show them your costumes really quickly. And plus <laughs> I want to give these ladies time to prepare. Let's just talk about how amazing mm -hmm. these gowns are. 
I'm just saying. And this is on a hanger, but I've already showed you guys a picture of this gown because I'm kind of obsessed. Wow, it's like, it looks so different up yeah. close. You yeah. guys, look how huge these sequins are. And I'll insert a picture here into the frame right there. That's, That's the best one because it's so sturdy. Yes. This is like... Beautiful, and this one I think is one of my favorites too. Yeah, but nice. I'm obsessed with cobalt blue. And then this one yeah, looks stunning yeah. on stage, you guys. No, actually, my favorite is the yellow. Show the yellow. And they're so gorgeous and vintage. Is that not gorgeous, guys? And this one's gorgeous mm -hmm. on stage. Yeah, this one has the. And there's she has all the hats. gorgeous women. Oh yeah, we yes. got. Hats. This is an incredible period, too. Hats. And these ladies model these Hats. costumes beautifully. Yes. yes! And can we talk about your shoes? These, the Patti Lapone. Mm -hmm. Okay, for you guys don't know, who don't know, Patti Lapone is a major Broadway star. She's done TV. Um, she's incredible, and she's kind of a legend in Broadway circles. And these costumes, a lot of them were acquired, is it from the Gypsy mm -hmm. Company? The, Gypsy the Broadway revival. revival that she starred in. So some of the ladies are wearing Patti Lapone's shoes. What is life? I'm just saying. I know. These so, are not hers. These are somebody named Braun. They're -A gorgeous. Yeah. Yes. yes. And you said so you much. had a pair. You just Yeah, these um these shoes are Patty's. Yes. She wears these in uh, I think it, it's like the main the main picture oh, where yeah. she's like wearing the red dress and it says gypsy uh -huh. wow so these are the shoes she's wearing so we've got some serious theater juju in yeah. here i'm just saying yeah. i scuffed them up pretty bad though i feel really bad <laughs> <laughs> don't feel <laughs> bad i need to let you guys prep but i was gonna yeah, say what's your favorite do you have like a favorite moment or a favorite thing about doing this show i kind i don't know i mean it's so much singing that it's like getting getting to the end of the show is like mm -hmm. the most exciting because you're like, okay, I made it through. <laughs> I made it. Um, I mean, singing the beginning of Anything Goes is fun mm -hmm. um, just because it's so like iconic mm -hmm. in terms of song. Um, and then I really like all the comedy, like the dogs and basically anything yeah. Andy gets to do. I'm like, right? I just yeah. want Andy's part. <laughs> oh my goodness. But you get, you're hilarious when you're on stage with him too, though. Like when you guys have that whole hilarious scene with Evelyn. Oh yeah, with Evelyn. <laughs> Evelyn. Yeah, I'm yeah, saying yeah. it like a woman. The character's yeah. name is Evelyn and it's a man. Yeah. I just like that we're getting to do a version that you're really never going to mm -hmm. see probably ever again. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. That's true. You know. Yeah. Parts of it. Parts of it are in the other shows. You're singing songs that people haven't heard, or if they have, yeah. it's been a really, really long time. Oh. You guys, thanks so much for taking the time. Cause yeah, thanks for visiting. There's a lot of prep work that goes in. I'm just doing a really easy part. These ladies have the hard work. Whatever, so. you have the best part in the whole show. You do. <laughs> the puppies. <laughs> First scene, like, stops the show. Uh -huh. The yeah. dogs stop the show, let's my, be real. I gotta, I gotta say, my white dress got entrance um, it's applause fantastic. yesterday. It's fabulous. So, we watch you like, come oh, on. Great. My dress is not the best thing in the no, show. No, but you you <laughs> saw you have this great walk when you walk in and the and the the little like, beads are like zhu 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 and everyone's like ooh. Yeah. Well, thanks for sharing guys and thanks for letting yeah. me come in and crash your dressing room. Bye. Yes, sir.